Hey what's up guys, today I'll be showing you a few awesome apps to increase your productivity. Let's get started. The first app on the list is Textband. With this app you can be able to type short words that the app will automatically replace with the chosen phrase. Examples are current date, your full name and address and whatever other long phrase you have. To give you a practical example, just imagine you're chatting with someone and he asks you for your email address. All you have to do is type in the word email and click on the green tick sign. So you can see how this app can make it very easy to input long information very quickly. By the way, it also supports tasker integration in case you want to insert variable phrases. Next we have Forest. It's basically a timer app but with extra features to keep you motivated to finish your task. So every time you start the timer, a tree is planted and it will appear in your forest for that day if the timer is completed. But if you continue using your phone or another app then the tree will die. You can check how many trees you planted for the day and how many were completed and how many withered away. To keep you interested, the app also has a store where you can buy different trees and bushes to grow in the forest. A sort of nice touch making it feel like a game. So this app you can focus more on your work than be distracted by your smartphone. After that is File Expert. So there are many file managers on the Google Play Store but I keep coming back to File Expert because of the variety of features it has. Starting off it has a clean material design. It also supports root access meaning that you can browse and edit system protected files. You can also register an account to get access to cloud storage right from the app and that is even private cloud storage. It also has a recycle bin in case you want to recover deleted files. Other features include a safe box to hide private files behind a secure lock, a super downloader if you want to quickly download large files and you can also connect it with your PC in the form of an FTP server. Overall it's loaded with useful features. Moving on we have Memo Gary, which is just another reminder app but with a clean and elegant design. Simply tap on the plus sign to add a new task. Here you give it a title, a description and even the date and time. For the previous reminders you can swipe right to mark it done, left to snooze it for another day or date and even swipe down to delete it. You can divide your tasks in different categories such as ideas, life goals, work, personal and many others. Next we have Lookup. It's an offline dictionary from which you can find the meaning of all sorts of different English words. But the best part about using it is when you're using another app such as Google Chrome or any other app where you can highlight a word and click on the copy, you get a pop-up showing the definition of that word. On the pop-up you get different options such as having the app say the word aloud or even adding a note to the word. So it can be a very useful app especially if you do a lot of reading. Moving on we have Monospace which I bet is the most minimalistic notes app you'll come across. You have your heading on top followed by the content. You can format your text to change its size, bold, italics and even add bullet points. You can also switch the app theme between dark and light. In the settings menu you get to customize a few different things such as the text size, title color, typeface and formatting styles. You can also turn on Google Drive Sync to back up your documents. After that is URL Shortener. So as the name suggests, you can basically use this app to shorten any URL making it easier for sharing purposes. The app can be very helpful to bloggers and content creators as they can easily share website links without occupying a lot of character space. For each shortened URL, you get all the necessary analytics such as the number of clicks, referrers, the browser the link was opened in, the countries and even the OS of the device the link was opened in. Overall it can be a very useful app to create and manage short URLs. The final app to increase your productivity is called Habits. Using this app you can increase your good habits such as drinking lots of water, reading, working out and others. So all you have to do is tick the task. Clicking on the habit gives you more information such as the habit strength, the days you completed it, the longest streaks and even the frequency of you completing your habit. So it's basically the app that you can use to keep up with the new year's resolution.